New at 11, we now know the two pedestrians hit near UC's campus are indeed University of Cincinnati students. One of them has died. The other now has minor injuries. Our Jake Ryle is live tonight with the details behind who police are looking for. Jake. Well, guys, you know, officials are telling us that that vehicle was a stolen vehicle involved in this crash. The driver crashed into two University of Cincinnati students. As you mentioned, one of them has died. Now, police are currently looking for the suspects involved in the investigation. On the ground, Cincinnati police hold paper bags filled with evidence near Jefferson and University Avenues, piecing together what exactly unfolded. From a nearby UC residence hall, students like John Sikora, a family member of a WCPO 9 News employee, heard it and called 911. It, it, was, it was so loud. I could hear it super clearly through my window. It just sounded like metal on metal, like how you would hear like an ordinary car crash, but it wasn't metal on metal, obviously. One UC student was hit in the crosswalk. Another hit several hundred feet away. He snapped this picture shortly after medics arrived, tending to one of the victims. Before that, Sakura says he saw several Good Samaritans doing what they could to help. One block north, near the intersection of MLK and Jefferson, the debris trail tells the story. A black Honda SUV crashed into a tree in the median and then came to a stop. Officials say three suspects got out of the car and ran away. Another one, who had minor injuries, stayed in the car. So, I don't know, always something. The incident has UC students alarmed. Yeah, that's terrifying because I make this walk two or three times a week both ways. I cross the street like three or four times, so it's not good. <laughs> not uh, good. I, I feel just horrible for the families. And also, um, you know, I've never had like an instance, at least up to this point, where I felt unsafe on campus. But, you know, that, that kind of, you know, I think it rattles me and a lot of other people here on campus, too. Now, less, th less than a block away from where all of this happened, a cardboard sign with a message, no more speeding, no more deaths. Once again, UC confirming within the past hour, two students were hit this afternoon. One of them has died. Police are now currently looking for a suspect or multiple suspects in connection with this investigation. We're going to be continuing to ask questions, and once we know more, we'll be sure to keep you updated on WCPO.com. For now, reporting live at UC, Jake Ryle, WCPO 9 News.